Hi guys, this is Ashwin again and in this video I'm gonna go ahead and show you how to install uh, the ice cream sandwich ROM from uh, Team Rocket onto your Samsung uh, Galaxy Note phone. Uh, this is generally installing a ROM uh, is pretty simple. I have a tutorial on how to flash ROMs onto the phone but this one is a little tricky so uh, I thought I'll go ahead and make a tutorial for it. With this tutorial I'm gonna go ahead on and show you how to transfer your apps from gingerbread onto the ice cream sandwich rom that is a little bit tricky so the first thing you do is go into titanium backup tap menu uh, select batch backup all user apps plus system data uh, in ice cream sandwich we are not going to restore, restore the system data but this will be useful in case you decide to come back to gingerbread so just so just hit backup all user apps and system data and select run the batch operation this will take a little bit of time uh, and once it's done get back to the video just pause the video right now and while you're doing it hit the subscribe button and the like button if you can just kidding guys okay guys now that the apps have been backed up what you need to do is connect your phone with a micro usb cable to the computer and transfer the files from link 1 and link 2 transfer these two files onto the phone uh, to the root of the SD card once you've transferred it go ahead and press the up volume key the power key and the home button all at the same time and the moment you see the galaxy note uh, display just let it go this is gonna reboot us into recovery so I've got hypertroid red pill recovery you might most probably have clockwork mode recovery it's similar so don't worry about it in clockwork mode you will have the option right over here with this you need to go into wipe menu and you're gonna basically do a wipe data slash factory reset it's just gonna take a few seconds so we need to wait okay it's done so uh, now I've also wipe Dalvik cache uh, in clockwork mode you can find the wipe Dalvik cache option uh, under advanced that's done so now go back go into install menu in clockwork mode you will have install from SD card so select that and navigate to Team Rocket ICS Note 1.4 Beta. Hit that and hit install. Okay, this is gonna take a while, so I'm gonna be back with you guys once it's done okay guys now the install from SD card is complete so this is very important so now if you go back and you wipe the wipe it again you do have a wipe data factory reset once again uh, if you don't wipe it over here you're gonna get, run into force closes and issues so make sure you do the wipe again so now go on and reboot the system okay guys we've got ice cream sandwich right now so the first thing you do is select any of the launchers I'm gonna use TouchWiz right now and that's ICS for you uh, we're not done just yet go into settings uh, go into security 
and make sure that unknown sources is selected go back out scroll down go into developer options and enable USB debugging so just to show you that's ice cream sandwich Android 4.0.3 okay so now what you do is you head on and head on over to the market so let me just get my Wi-Fi on so now I'm connected to Wi-Fi now if you go into the market where is the market now okay go into market you add your account and you download titanium backup again and once you're done once you're done downloading titanium backup get back to the video pause it right now go into the market sign up get titanium backup installed and then get back to the video okay guys I've downloaded titanium backup from the market uh, for anyone who's actually planning on installing the titanium backup via apk files a small note make sure you install the latest version that's 4.8.0 uh, the 3 series will not run um, properly with ICS so you need the latest one. now what you need to do is hit menu go into batch and over here I know that we did backup the system data but do not restore missing apps and system data because uh, the system data will conflict and it will end up freezing your phone or throwing up force close errors so just tap restore missing apps with data go ahead and run the batch operation this will take about five to ten minutes so depending on the number of apps that you've backed up so I'm just gonna leave it over here and I'll get back to you once it's done okay now uh, the restore has, has been done so as you can see I've got all my launchers back including the go launcher X and uh, my phone is back to yeah with go launcher X you will have some problem with the widgets you just need to add the widgets again and that's not a big pain as long as I get all my apps back I'm happy so I've got my phone back to exactly how it was before I installed ICS uh, but one more thing that you will note over here is let me just quickly log into the market so one thing you would note over here is uh, in the market once you go into my apps though your apps have been restored not all your apps would show up over here so what you need to do for this is uh, once again go to titanium backup tap menu market tools and market doctor and over here select user and system apps and now select link the selected apps to the market so this will take a few minutes okay so now that's done okay now what you do is you go ahead and hold the volume up button the power button and the menu button at the same time let it go once you see galaxy note displayed and now do not wipe anything this time just go into uh, install zip from SD card choose zip from SD card and this time select the Team Rocket ICS Note 1.5 beta.zip scroll down and hit yes and now uh, this update will be installed I'll be back with you once it's done the update has been installed so again don't wipe anything just go back and reboot the system so we're back up guys sorry I ran out of battery so you know it took me a little while to get it back in the meantime you know I've just gone ahead and switched wallpapers and stuff uh, so in all we have your backup again and uh, just to show you guys 
about phone we've got team rocket version 1.5 beta installed and the other thing that we need to check uh, let me quickly get into market go into my apps and you can see all the uh, all my apps are now detected so that's pretty much it guys when it comes to the beta version of team rockets ICS from uh, I hope I helped you with this tutorial uh, if you want to go back to stock gingerbread you cannot uh, just flash via clockwork mod that doesn't work uh, what you need to do is you need to go back and uh, install you need to use Odin and flash uh, stock ROM onto the device and then you need to use the Zergresh exploit uh, that is you know using the CF root file and uh, to root the phone and then again go ahead and install rocket rom if this doesn't make any sense to you click the link that pops up right now uh, that will take you to my tutorial on how to uh, uh, root, the, root the galaxy node and that's the procedure that you need to repeat in order to go from the uh, uh, beta version of ICS back to gingerbread so that's pretty much it for this tutorial thanks a lot for watching guys uh, hit subscribe if you can uh, hope you do and the like button of course uh, again as usual if you have any kind of con I mean any kind of uh, queries or if you, have, if you run into any issues leave a comment or send me a message uh, I'd prefer if you can email me that's uh, ash at cursedforever.com uh, you can follow me on twitter at cursedforever uh, the link to my facebook page is in the description so uh, once again, thanks a lot for watching guys. Uh, you have a great day. Bye-bye now.